Brigadier General Alareza Sabahiford conducted an inspection tour of tactical radar sites, observation posts, and artillery positions along the northwestern border of the country on Monday. Air defense, based on its indigenous capabilities and domestic capacities, is at a very high level of readiness and combat capability, General Sabahiford declared during his visit. He highlighted that the core strength of the air defense lies in its young and specialized personnel. Our nation's youth and defense industry experts are equipped with the latest global knowledge. Thus, the production and mass manufacturing of radar systems, drones, and more are carried out by our skilled Iranian youth, he added. Underscoring the critical role of advanced training and education in bolstering the nation's defense capabilities. The general also emphasized the effectiveness and decisiveness of the air defense force in every field it has entered. The Army's air defense force has always been effective and decisive in every field it has entered and performs its assigned missions with authority, he noted, reflecting on the force's track record of success and reliability. Reflecting on the progress made since the early days of the Islamic Revolution, General Sabahiford stated, Today, in terms of military capability, we are at a much higher position compared to the early days of the Islamic Revolution. He attributed this advancement to the sacrifices and selflessness of the warriors from the Iran-Iraq War stressing that it is the duty of current and future generations to preserve and enhance the achievements of the Islamic system. Further, General Sabahiford reiterated the importance of national elections, aligning with the leader's views. According to the leader's statements, the key to solving the country's problems is holding elections with maximum public participation, he emphasized. He described elections as a crucial and valuable opportunity for the nation, asserting that maximum participation is a duty and a tribute to the martyrs who sacrificed their lives for the country. The general concluded by expressing the ongoing commitment to fully implementing the leader's directives within the Air Defense Force, ensuring that the force remains a formidable and well-supported component of Iran's military. In recent years, Iranian military specialists and engineers have achieved notable advancements in producing a diverse array of domestically developed equipment, fostering self-reliance within the armed forces. Officials from Iran affirmed their commitment to enhancing the nation's military capabilities, emphasizing their defensive nature. Iran unequivocally states that negotiations will not affect its defense capabilities. Ayatollah Saeed Ali Khamenei, the leader of the Islamic Revolution, consistently emphasizes the importance of maintaining and enhancing Iran's defense capabilities. Iran's air defense capabilities restricting foreign forces in region. The chief commander of the Iranian army's air defense force has praised the formidable defense capabilities of his unit and its ability to employ cutting-edge military weapons and equipment to effectively deter foreign forces from encroaching in the West Asia region. Brigadier General Alareza Sabahiford made the remark in a ceremony held in Qatam Al Anbiya Air Defense Academy in the capital Tehran on Tuesday as he pointed to the significant role of research in his unit's achievements and deterrence power.
In the Air Defense Force, paying heed to training, research, scientific development and the skills of personnel are among the pivotal strategies, Sabahiford said. Qatam al Anbiya Air Defense Academy, as the authority in the air defense of the armed forces, tries to develop the Army's defense in all areas, and maintain and promote the strength and combat readiness of the force," he added. The senior Iranian commander pointed to the wide and diverse use of weapons in line with the multi-layered defense of the country's air borders, saying, the capabilities of the Army's air defense force have limited foreign forces in the region. Stressing that conducting research in the Air Defense Force is a must, Sabahiford also said, scientific progress accompanied by insight and vigilance, while reducing the effect of sanctions, has placed the air defense in a superior position, which is a source of pride for everyone.